one historical event actually happened today in Chennai. On January 12th, it was in Delhi to Parliament. Now it is in South India from Chennai. On February 1, 2024, 16 student organizations under the banner of United Students of India took out a rally in Chennai. More than 5,000 students participated in this rally held against the implementation of NEP, NEET and other policies affecting the student community. The United Students of India has accused the NEP of being a replica of the Kulakalvi Thittam known as the caste-based or hereditary-based education system which functions against the social justice. We participated in this Chennai rally to show our opposition against NEET and NEP and BJP which are against the social justice of India. How is NEP against the social justice? NEP is something that is indirectly imposing the Kolakalvi system on the people of India. It took thousands and thousands of years for the people of India to come out of the Kolakalvi system. And again, are we going back to that position? Think, following the principles of Lenin, let us learn, propagandize and organize and that is what you are seeing here. The United Students of India organized the rally and questioned the Union government for its policies on privatizing the education sector. They accused the Modi government of continuously attacking the education policy and weakening the public education system. The United Students of India held the rally with the slogan, Reject NEP, Save Education, Reject BJP and Save India. Today we are gathered here in Chennai on behalf of the United Students of India to rally, uh, taking across all the student community and the youth together to question the BJP, RSS-led central government that why continuously in the past 10 years they have been attacking and bringing in anti-student policies. This United Students of India, that means the platform of 16 student organization. It is first time in Indian history, it is happens. So the slogan, what we are raising by United Students of India, that is reject NEP, save education, reject BJP, save India. The organizations also slammed the BJP-led government for the vehement attempts to commercialize and communalize the secular education system and the intention of the government to destroy the public education system prevailing in several states in the country. The BJP regime, the past 10 years, we faced a lot of anti-student policies and the anti-student schemes they are introduced and they are completely privatization to the education. So that's why they are introduced to NEET examination and the QT examination and the other common entrance examinations and the new education policy 2020. The, all the education system is cover, sovereignization of education, commercialization of education and centralization of education. We the students of Tamil Nadu and we the students of all over the India defeat BJP for save the students and the save education and the save India. That privatization is being encouraged by this government and public sector education is being dismantled. We stand united against any sort of anti-student policies that this current central government is trying to bring. We stand for an united India which will not be divided on any communal lines. We stand for an education system which will stand for a scientific temperament will stand for the democratic, progressive and secular ethos and safeguard the upcoming generation and the student community. The joint platform of the 16 student organizations called upon the student community to defeat the BJP in the upcoming elections 2024 highlighting the need to defeat BJP to save education and India. So that reject BJP, that reject BJP actually start from southern India. So already Kerala and Tamil Nadu is the best example for rejecting BJP. So in the next election, it will be rejecting BJP starting from uh, South India and it will reach up to Delhi and total North India. So that's the only way to save our education, save our country, save our democracy, save our federalism, only way we have to go for, forward and only we can live peacefully and we can have education and we can have a peaceful life in India. Uh, for that, we have to defeat BJP. Because the Modi government comes again 
in 2024 we are not into allow the studies higher education all over the india the universities and the campuses bjp agenda will implement to the new education policy so the students the entire community of india and tamil nadu also we want to defeat bjp with no mercy we want to defeat bjp politically electorally and ideologically we want to defeat bjp to save the nation save the students community